now we will draw our beam great beam actually so for that i will close this 3d windows i will add or i'll open our model explorer so that uh, we get some extra benefit while working i'll zoom it little bit done okay so they have an option uh, we have two options to draw our beam actually so here draw beam and they have a quick so what is the difference between them so if we select that option then it will create beam with respect to grid okay just simply when you click on a grid it will give you a beam but if you use that option then we'll draw beam or column what you need actually it was beam if you click that option from that point to another point where you will click actually it will give you a beam like that okay but uh, so by using the two option you are able to draw your beam simply select 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 and press delete that's it otherwise after just like select and click here delete otherwise come here edit and click here delete uh, and otherwise click delete option on your keyboard that's it now let's start drawing our so i'll click on that option first and i'll change our grid beam and every option will be same moment release will be continuous so i just click here then i'll click here and see here we are not able to draw our column also not here we're not able to use that option but here we're able to use that option so in this way just we have to draw where we are able to draw and uh, where we are not able to draw we have to maintain and i think here 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 okay uh, now i'll click here and use grid beam on so from that point to that point that point simply just click here and then escape again click here already grid beam the option of grid beam is selected okay then click this point 
must remember uh, grid point should be visible then click okay done Here. I think this this side is okay now from that point to here it's a very complicated situation actually so uh, you have to do it very carefully done Uh, if you see that this option is not working for you then go ahead draw then snap option and uh, click on intersection extension parallel uh, and check which option is suitable for you line and frame it's then you will see that option middle point or line ends okay so here Uh, I hope I was done. Mm -hmm. Maybe here. Also, I need to draw a beam that point to that point click here to show the extrude view so that we can understand if we miss something
I hope we have done everything perfectly. Now uh, we need to draw this one and also this one. So here uh, we'll uh, we'll draw uh, this two beam, and here we have a, a staircase. Okay, so we'll do it later, and I think it's okay. We have done everything perfectly. And here maybe uh here we have a beam but uh, i think we just come here get beam that is available just okay so uh, we have done it we have done it perfectly I'll just so I'm done now we'll if we go here see perfectly we have uh, completed our all of beam and what we need actually now we'll go for replicate our model and then uh, we'll go over on further text.